Students in Grand Rapids still have a few more days left to enjoy their summer, but the district is getting ready for their return. Yeah, the, the teachers don't have any more days no. left. <laughs> <laughs> and there are new guidelines in place this year for diseases like COVID and monkeypox. We have Taylor Morris here in the studio with the policies you can expect this year. Good morning, Taylor. Donovan, Teresa, good morning. Grand Rapids Public Schools announced new health guidelines just in time for the start of the new school year. The new guidances are recommendations from the Michigan Department of Health and Human Services and the Kent County Health Department. Although masks are not required, Grand Rapids Public Public schools is encouraging all students to wear them. It is also encouraging, they are also encouraging all students and staff to get vaccinated. Now students who have a confirmed case of COVID will still have to isolate for five days. However, the CDC says anyone positive for COVID should stay home and only return once they've been fever free for 24 hours and all symptoms have begun to subside. The CDC also recommends wearing a mask on days six through 10 when in public. Confirmed cases of COVID-19 also still need to be reported to the school health offices. When it comes to monkeypox, it can be spread through anyone through close person, personal and frequent skin to skin contact. According to the Michigan Department of Health and Human Services, it is believed that direct contact with monkeypox, scabs, or the rash or body fluids is the most common way that it is being spread. If you feel sick or have a rash, the Grand, Rapids, or the Grand Rapids Public Schools says students should not attend school or social gatherings and contact your health provider. In the studio, Taylor Morris, News 8.